this is our van, our home. We're living out of it for about 10 days. I'm about to show you around. We'll start back here in the back. These two doors open all the way up. And there is plenty of storage underneath these beds for all your luggage. You got two bunk beds here, the bottom, three sleeping bags, plenty of room for three people on the bottom, two people on top. We only have three people, so we have plenty of room. They work great for five as well. There's also, before I close this, a charging port back here. This runs on the second battery, so even if the van is off, you will still be able to charge cell phones or anything else that you can plug into here. Close these up and move around to the side. Side here is the main area, nice and big. I'm over six feet tall. I can stand up very comfortably, just fine in here. Uh, you can see right next to me, we have a nice counter, a sink, and plenty of storage. And underneath there's a couple jugs for water. Uh, you could just refill these at any waterfall or stream that you come across here in Iceland. It's really wonderful. You also have a drawer here for miscellaneous stuff. Uh, a fridge here to keep anything cold if you need it to be extra cold. Um, and you also get this handy stove. It comes with this carrying case. You just open it up, pull it out, flip the top over, and you've got yourself a stove. Put it away, just flip that over, put it back in its case, Throw it back in the bin. This bin here is full of miscellaneous plates, bowls, utensils, anything you need to eat with. Uh, in here there's also a lot of storage up here. If you need to store miscellaneous food or paper towels or any anything extra that you might need to store. Uh, there's a switch here for lights that also runs on that second battery. So even if the car is off, these lights will still function. Same thing goes with the heater. There's a very nice warm heater comes out right here that runs on the second battery. So even if the van is off, the heater will still heat, which is great because it heats through the night. So if you're sleeping in these beds overnight, it might get cold. With this heater, you won't even notice it. There's also these table and chairs back here. So if you want to take any of it out of the van, uh, and have a nice meal outside of the van, you can just set up the table and chairs and eat out here. Uh, not only is that, but there's also this table right here that you can pull up right in the middle here of the van and eat inside the van if you prefer. So we're coming around to the front. You've got your GPS here, uh, charging cable, um, and a, a nice window mount for the GPS. You also have a nice Wi-Fi hotspot. It's incredibly reliable. There are very, very few cold spots here where you will not have Wi-Fi. And the Wi-Fi is very fast. It's been wonderful. I'm going to climb in here. Plenty of room to maneuver. I'll show you around. There's three seats in the front here. This middle one also converts into a nice tabletop with a swiveling tray in front and converts just as easily back into a seat. Uh, you have storage up here, your visors, uh, storage on both sides and in the middle here. You have storage right here for any miscellaneous papers or anything you want to store up front here. Uh, two charging ports. Um, you have your radio here and what I like to do with the radio is they have this very handy clipboard right here. What I would do is, pretend this is my phone, I would put my phone up here, connect it to the radio's Bluetooth, and just stream music throughout the car. And this just folds back in there when you're not using it. So that has been a tour of our van. Hope you enjoyed.